Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right. Mm-hmm. Well, I mean, look, I'm trying to help you out. I, so. I know you are, John. Try, Thank you very much. Where, where's the craziest place you've ever whacked it? The craziest place I've ever whacked it. Um, like at uh, school? <laughs> no. <laughs> you ever whack it in school? I'll whack um, it in school. I have not. I've, I've heard of people whacking it in the library. I thought that always sounded <laughs> ever, pretty wild. The library here? Ever whack it in, on Olga's grandma's pillow? No, that that <laughs> really. She's if, snoring? if you knew Olga's grandma, that would not be appealing in the slightest bit, John. I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so let, let me ask you: Are you afraid to have sex? I don't believe in the slightest bit. No, okay. I. So then, was that really? Was that why you ended your high school relationship? Just because you thought she wanted it too soon? Um, or was it a little bit of fear? It, because I feel like a lot of guys have a fear of that. But once it, once you let it happen, then you're good. I think the reason why I really ended it with Olga didn't have anything to do with, like, sexuality or, you know, that I wasn't, didn't feel like, you know, putting out or anything. It, uh-huh. was, it was a lot of issues outside of sex that okay. were, you know, not working out so well in the relationship. Issues. Yeah. I got you. So I just want to open up the airlines right now. If anyone has a question for Sam, our Virgin of the Week, you can give us a call at 570-484-2212. Once again, that's 570-484-2212. If you have questions for our Virgin of the Week, Sam Doan. Uh, Sam, I do have another question that I'd like to ask you. Yeah. Um, are you familiar with the parts of the vagina? <laughs> I mean, like, when you do finally have the opportunity to, uh, you know, finally pop your cherry, are you confident that you're going to be able to satisfy your I think woman? I'll do just fine. You know, the Internet, it, it, there's a lot out there, so I'll, okay. I'll manage. <laughs> so, so do you He's watch been it? studying up, <laughs> researching, <laughs> studying, uh, late-night sessions. Do you watch it? Yeah, exactly. Do you watch a lot of porn? Hours, is, is this what we're saying? Does our virgin of the week... <laughs> Watch a lot of porn. Not a lot. No, not at all. I'll unfortunately, I'm, I'm, I'm not a. I'm, I'm no uh, porn fiend by any means, unfortunately. But um, you know, I, I, I'll manage when the time comes. Just fine, I think. <laughs> are, are you Are you well endowed? Well endowed. I'm. You. What is? What do you mean? Uh, are sorry. you uh, Are you packing? Am I packing? Oh, I mean, you are you Are you average? Are you Are, <laughs> are you exceptional? Well, I mean, Aaron swears that I have a Coke can sized cock, but I, I'm telling you, <laughs> one of our oh, I'm, dirty I'm, words, I'm, Sam. Right. We We do want to take this to I'm listen. He may be a virgin, but he doesn't have a virgin mouth. Oh, Sam, there are words I'm very sorry. on I, the radio that we are not allowed to say. And unfortunately, you just said one of them. I am very so sorry, please, John. please do not do that again. I am uh, so sorry. It, you are forgiven. Um, yes, you, you cannot say what you just <laughs> said. Um, I don't want to know what Aaron thinks of it. <laughs> I want to know what Sam Doan thinks of it. I mean, um, is it average? Is it exceptional? Or is it, you know, somewhere in between? Um, I've always said that, you know, I don't think I need to worry about anything like that yet because I haven't even gotten close to anyone, you know, needing to deal with that. So I'll, I'll just try and get myself to the position where someone actually, ha- you know, is seeing it before I worry about the size. I got you. Um, okay. I've got a ways to go there, I think. Okay. I have here in the studio, I have a diagram of a vagina, <laughs> okay? I also have a uh, banana. And he has a banana. So we have a diagram That's a terrible of a banana. Vagina. <laughs> That's like the worst looking banana I've ever seen. Are, because just because it's black doesn't mean it doesn't work. No, Are not, you trying to say you don't like black bananas? The tip of bananas? the banana is falling off. <laughs> the tip is falling, maybe it's about to fall. <laughs> Never mind. <laughs> yes. But Sam, we have a diagram of a vagina. I, I see it. And yeah. we have a banana which resembles, a, you can imagine what it resembles. Yes, I so, can, certainly. <laughs> if you would, would you please show Linda what exactly you would do what? if this banana was yours and this vagina was hers? Because you just said that Linda is a babe, <laughs> Linda is hot, and she is. I absolutely agree. Well, thank you, so show Linda what your technique would be, and then, Linda, you can, you can grade him on a scale of 1 to 10, just so we know, we can maybe either give him some confidence <laughs> or we can help him to know what he needs to improve upon mm-hmm. in order to finally pop his cherry and get this, you know, sex thing on, on the road. John, the things you come up with. I, 
All Things Sex Radio. If you have questions for us, give us a call, <laughs> 570-484-2212. Once again, 570-484-2212. All right, I am giving Sam a banana and a vagina diagram. <laughs> Okay, John, um, what would I do with this what banana? What would you do? Would show, you do? show Linda what, what you would you do. What I would do. Okay, there you go, Linda. What, do you, what are you thinking of this? With, is he he's, in the right area? He is. He's, he's I, does he have, he has good aim. Yes. Um, just so I know, is he in the vaginal entrance? Did he... Yes. Did he participate in any foreplay? Did no. he stimulate any no. other areas of nope. the vagina? He just went right in. Is that a problem? <laughs> he he should probably focus on the outer region as well. A little bit. You know, you want to kind of stimulate fun. it. Yeah. You do kind of want to stimulate it, Sam. Okay. All um, right. You don't want to just go for the gusto because it won't be very gusto-ish if you don't. You know, you can't really eat the food until you preheat it. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? So yep. you really got to kind of get it ripe for the taking okay. before you actually take it. Is that a fair assessment, Linda? Yes. Okay. So, Linda, can you please take the diagram as well as the banana and show Sam what exactly he should be doing? Well, when this you don't use the banana <laughs> at first. Right. So, you can use your fingers if you'd like. No, I'm not. <laughs> I'm not doing anything with that diagram. Me. Why not? Because. Are you going to make me show him? You're the man. I am the man. Thank well. you. Thank you. It feels so good hearing you say that. I am the, the man, man. John. I am the freaking man. You're the man, so show him. I am the man. Like him, what a man does. All right, but listen, I am a man with a very vulgar mouth, so I don't know how I can um, describe this without saying something I might not. I've already probably said something you I'm probably not supposed have. to say. You probably have. But it's it's. 11.41 in the Almost, morning. Like, yeah. decency it's doesn't apply. Are we being obscene or are we being night, indecent? John, not in the morning. Whatever it is. Listen, I'm focused on the vagina. I know. You're looking at it right now. I <laughs> am. All right? But, yeah. I don't know. Listen. All I can tell you is this. How about I just point it out to him without actually saying anything? So I get to grade you? And you can grade me. Okay. You see this little area right here? He gets a I five, by do, the John. way. He gets a five. Because Sam gets a five the, out of ten on his vagina skills. He forgot... You okay. are right that's for pretty it. good Listen, for a virgin, isn't it? I'll, that's pretty good yeah. for a virgin. Yes, you know you you you've crossed the fifty cent threshold. Okay. okay, but listen, there's certain things that I like. Oh, we have a call. If this is Professor Stringer, I'm running out of the studio before <laughs> public safety gets here. But uh, let's take this call. Yes, hello. You are on the air live on All Things Sex Radio. Who am I speaking with? Uh, this is Aaron. What's going on, Aaron? Nothing much. Um, I just, uh, I was wondering, um, Linda, are you seeing anyone? Am I? I am seeing someone. Okay, because this is what I was thinking. I think that we should find somebody to maybe kiss Sam to see what kind of, like, first base game he's got. Because if we can't assess the first and second base, how are we, we going to help him with third and fourth? Uh, and uh, yeah, I mean, that's a good idea. That, However, that's a fantastic idea. Uh, I will say this. I don't know if anyone was listening prior to All Things Sex Radio. We do have a special guest here in the studio. There was a show on prior to our show. And the host of that show, which doesn't have a name yet, Ariel <laughs> Guerra, she is in the studio with us right now. So I would just like to ask you, this is a spur-of-the-moment decision. If you want to punch me afterwards, you certainly may. <laughs> Are you willing to uh, do us a great service, be a great civil servant here on All Things Sex Radio, and test out the kissing skills of one Sam Doan? Is that a possibility? I'm, I'm going to steal Linda's mic for a second. Um, okay. In all honesty, maybe if this was at a, in a different sort of atmosphere, but uh -huh. I, I don't think I could because I just, I don't know. I just, I couldn't. All right, no well. No offense. You seem like a nice kid. Well, I'm not kissing him. <laughs> That's all I know. Hey, Ron, right? will you come and kiss him? <laughs> hey, Ron, you want, you want to come suck face with a virgin? Do your thing, brother. You know what I'm saying? Like, oh, you're I, only a couple I blocks away. I could, but I'm already in bed. All right. All right. Do you have anything else for us? 
Nope, that'll be it. All right, Aaron, thanks a lot. All right, bye. bye.